More than 34 million Americans have diabetes, and for those who have type 2 diabetes, obesity often does play a major role. In our health cast, we're going to look at how existing as well as emerging drugs are helping diabetics lose that weight and even improve their heart health as well. Sandra Panny wasn't surprised when she was diagnosed with diabetes 25 years ago. She struggled for years to lose weight and does have an extensive family history of the disease. My mother, my father, and uh, my brother. Endocrinologist Dr. Paul Gellinger says the newest medication under study is a monoclonal antibody that appears to lower blood sugar and help with weight loss. That lowering of the uh hemoglobin A1C by about 0.75 percent and they had nice uh, moderate degree weight loss six or seven percent of the body weight uh, and it was uh, uh, and without lean uh, body weight loss it was all uh, adipose tissue which is very selective so it's a nice result. But he cautions that the study sample was small and it could be years before this drug is available. The good news, there are other medications already on the market that can do the same thing and more. The GLP-1 agonist class of drugs is, is, is uh, well known to produce early satiety, whereby uh, an individual on these medicines will feel full halfway through the meal, perhaps, and stop eating the, the rest of their meal and leave their plate. Patients also get less hungry between meals on these medications and are at a lower risk of a heart attack. Another class of drugs can cause patients to urinate out excess glucose as well as excess calories. The really unique thing about this class of drugs is that besides lowering glucose, blood sugar, well, by peeing out the glucose in the urine and lowering the blood sugar, controlling the diabetes, turns out these drugs have very powerful benefits for Re, uh, reducing the uh, instance of congestive heart failure. This class of drugs, called the SLG2 inhibitors, can also protect the kidneys. They achieve their original purpose, but they do so much more. Sandy didn't have high expectations when she began to take the medications, but became pleasantly surprised with the results. I've lost about 20 pounds total. And, uh, you know, they say 12 pounds, but I've lost 20. I'm happy. <laughs> I bet. All right, good for her. Well, the latest research into the monoclonal antibody drug to reduce fat mass is in its very early stages, and it could be some time before it's approved for general use.